know how it is when you go and get a new dog, you're never really quite sure how they'll turn out and what special qualities they'll have. And that's the way that it was when we got our new dog, Quinn. That's him jumping on his mum, and also with his new mum, starting just exactly as he means to carry on. We were pretty certain right away that he would be very good for, well, snuggles and cuddles and helping you sleep, and we are fairly sure that he'd be playful. Oh, and did we mention playful? And playful, and playful, and, uh, by the way, playful. We were right about all of those. Some doubts did creep in when he managed to get rid of two mats, both of them brand new, both within ten days. And, of course, the temptation was to send him to jail. However, we realized quite quickly that he'd simply burrow his way out of it. And then one day, right after Thanksgiving and just before Christmas, I realized he was watching TV. Now, we knew this wouldn't be a problem because he defended Luke Skywalker from the Sand People, hated Stormtroopers, and loved R2-D2 and C-3PO. But then, immediately after Christmas, came, well, that Volkswagen ad. So there it was. We'd established that he loved going for a drive, likes seat belts, not too much, loves David Attenborough, hates antelopes, <coughs> but pretty much nothing could have prepared us for, well, Donald Trump. I suppose, in retrospect, we should have all known that the man known for a specific signature phrase, you fired, would go through White House and administration personnel as speedily as Congress goes through sexual harassment settlement funds. Not just the firing of James Comey, of course, which is its own special constitutional case. You're fired! But the long, long list. National Security Advisor Mike Flynn. You're fired. And Press Secretary Sean Spicer. Fired! And Chief of Staff Reince Priebus. You're fired. And HHS Secretary Tom Price. You're fired. And Communications Director Anthony Scaramucci. You're fired. And senior strategist Steve Bannon. You're fired. And whatever it was exactly that Sebastian <coughs> did. You're fired. The list goes on and on and on. You're fired. Hey, I'm not even listing anyone anymore, Mr. President. <coughs> You're fired. Okay, this is just weird. You're fired. Get out of here. Of course, the president might want to think twice before going after special counsel Robert Barr. <coughs> firing <coughs> him might create even more of a constitutional crisis than the firing of <coughs> Comey. Potentially might ultimately. <coughs> yeah, you might want to think twice about that one, sir. <laughs>